Good morning, everybody. Today is Friday, March 4th, uh, 2022. Whew, we had quite a... Oops, other way, Maverick. We had quite a cold snap uh, yesterday. It is down, down to 19 degrees from... I think it was 41 yesterday, so a little bit nippy out, but that's fine. It's definitely not the coldest that we've headed out. And usually the coldest we'll get here is usually in February. Um, in the morning, sometimes it'll get down to about zero degrees Fahrenheit. Sometimes maybe a one or two degrees below. But that's about it for the most part. And we'll hit that maybe probably 10 days a year. This is definitely colder than normal for this area. But clear skies, no rain. I think it's supposed to get a bit warmer, but not too warm. Actually, I think they said the high today is our normal low, which is gonna be around 40 degrees. And we're getting closer and closer to March. Well, closer, <laughs> where are we in March? Closer and closer to spring, that is. Personally, I'm actually kind of more of a winter person myself. It's a lot of advantages to hiking in winter over the summer months, definitely. Uh, there's obviously less people when you hike in the winter. And um, you have less bugs. Oh gosh, you know. My wife and I both, Pepper and I, we, um, we both have, I guess what they call the sweet blood, where bugs just love to attack us. And uh, you're, you head out on a trail, at least in this area, you end up with so many bugs, because a lot of times our trails go around wetlands, and oh, there's our woodpecker friend. But those, uh, those areas are just uh, breeding grounds for mosquitoes which is not fun at all, among other bugs too. Like little gnats and stuff that will get to you. Nothing crazy like I hear about down south and we don't get the massive flies that you get up in Canada toward the Arctic region, but you do get a fair share of bugs. And you know, the ground's actually a little bit firmer too. In the summer sometimes, uh, after rainfall you can get quite a bit of mud on some of the trails i think our trails here are a little bit more natural that's a nice way of saying not as well maintained but still really enjoy them we do have a bit of a unique terrain here in the area in pennsylvania we're at that freeze uh, and thaw line so obviously our roads and stuff get messed up but during the uh, last glacier migrations we were towards the end of the glacier migration down which means some of our taller mountains literally got their tops taken off as those glaciers moved down so you'll see exposed boulder fields and everything and um, if, if anyone's ever watched videos on hiking the Appalachian Trail, I, a lot of times the hikers will refer to Pennsylvania as the state where boots come to die. Because some of the trails around here are probably more rock and broken rock than your traditional trail. Oh, good. Though. Another nice thing, though, about uh, hiking in winter is that because of that, you know, as, as it gets colder, Especially in the mornings like mornings like this, you don't have to worry about mud at all because it'll be completely frozen or pretty close to frozen. You can find uh, positives and I guess in everything if you really think about it, right? I don't know if there's anything that's truly negative, even in the worst situations. 
something positive can usually come out of it somehow. Not saying that the the good always outweighs the bad in those situations, of course. But you just don't want to get your head thinking that the world is just a negative place to be because it really isn't. It really just comes down to your point of view, right? Anyway, I think it's gonna be a good hike. Looking forward to this. Even though it's a bit nippy, hopefully I feel my fingers by the time I get back. And um, that's gonna do it. If you enjoy these videos, uh, of course, appreciate it if you click that like button and subscribe for future content if you haven't already. Try to release as much as I can during the week while working a full-time job. And I uh, hope to see you again on a future video. Until then, get out there, make your own outdoor adventures, and take care. <laughs>